What's up everybody and welcome back to my Pokemon Black 2 Blind Nuzlocke Challenge. Last time we defeated Sharon, the first gym leader and the normal type gym leader located in your hometown. So apparently we're fighting Albert here. He's a preschooler out about on his own. Uh, I don't exactly know where his mom is, but she's uh, she's not a very good parent apparently. So we're just going to scratch the Psyduck up pretty good and... Uh, since Psyducks are super stupid, I have no idea what to do about this. He's all like, I guess I'll throw this water sport out and, uh, you know, maybe, I don't know, it'll stop your fire powers from happening there, Purloin. You know, the fire powers you don't have. You know, Psyducks are not the brightest, but... Luckily, even if he knocks me down below half, I got the Orenberry, and I get a critical hit. Very nice. That's what I got the Orenberries on there for anyway, since basically after the beginning of the game, they're completely useless. So, uh, talk to huge ass here. I have to get stronger than Team Plasma. Oh, God. All right, let's grab this. Great ball. Ooh, what a find. All right, let's, uh, let's fight something here in the grass just to get a look at it. It's supposed to be tougher Pokemon in this dark green grass, and we got two Pyduffs, which I actually don't think I've seen while recording, but those are basically the Pidgeys of this game, for for all intents and purposes, but pretty cool, like little pigeons, I guess never had pigeons before in Pokemon, I'd like to catch one, I'd like to have a flying type, that'd be very nice, Gust gonna do some good damage, Orenberry's gonna kick in, and uh, Puss is gonna be fine. Just eating, just munching away there on that Orenberry. Fantastic. Another Gust! Guys, quit bullying, alright? If you were in Smash, you guys would get banned. Banned for targeting one person. Banned! Speaking of Smash, super excited for tonight. Uh, although this is recorded in the past for you. In the future for me, tonight is the night that Smash Bros. Uh, comes out for the Wii U. So I'm super excited about that. And I'm going to go pick that up at midnight, play it for an hour or two, go to sleep, and then uh, get up for work like five hours later. Because, uh, you know what? It's worth it. Play a couple hours of Smash. Of course, uh... Oh, wow. Did I just attack nothing? Hopefully it attacks Pyduff now. No, it's gonna attack no- oh, okay, good. I was gonna say, hopefully it attacks Pyduff and just not nothing. It'd be like, your attack missed! NOTHING! But, of course I'm gonna main my, uh... I'm gonna be maining... My main man, Little Mac. And, uh, my secondary main will be, uh, my main for the first two, uh, rounds of Smash- or... Yeah, first- no, well, first three, actually. First three rounds of, uh, Smash Bros. games. Captain Falcon, because I love me some Captain Falcon, but I'm going to run back quick. Heal up, because it's uh, it's not too far to get back there. Plus, I don't have to go through any grass in order to get back to where I was anyway, so... But yeah, super excited for Smash, and played it a little bit on my, my roommate's 3DS. Um, it's fine on the 3DS, it's just kind of small, and I don't particularly care for it on the 3DS because it's a console game and uh, yeah although I did get uh, I did get a Nintendo code for the uh, Nintendo Club code for the uh, soundtrack and uh, Mewtwo so once I get my Wii U I'm gonna put that in there and uh, get my soundtracks blast that shit while I'm heading to work you can be on green greens while heading to work be like all right, let's throw another Horenberry on the pussy here. And let's take on this, uh, looks like another preschool. Hold on, let's go down here. Anything? Nothing. All right, let's take on this other preschooler here. Hey, look! Hey, look at my awesome Pokemons! Wow, kid! Those are some cool Pokemons! Oh, crazy! Preschooler Lynn. Just got a little pup. I really want to get a little pup. They're super cool. And they evolve three times. Or, they evolve twice, so they have a third evolution. They have a third form. 
which uh, not a lot of uh, not a lot of Pokemon in the early games. Usually, uh, well, it, by early games I mean early in the game. Like Pidgey, for example, had uh, three evolution, a uh, third evolutionary form. Unlike uh, Rattata, that's uh, sort of like Lillipup. I don't know if Pidove has uh, a third one either, but I like thinking of Pidove too. But you know what? I'm not really. I don't really remember that many Pokemon from Black and from Black and White, the fifth generation, really in general. So I'm happy to use whoever. I really don't have any preferences. I did like. Uh, I think it's called Muna. It's the the psychic type called that little guy Bubblegum, and uh, it's pretty cool. I think I did that in my first uh, playthrough when I did it for the uh, other collaboration channel. Got an antidote. All right. Uh, shit. No! Not a wild battle against a pat rat. Wow, level three. Yeah, I guess that dark grass is uh is kind of better. Just by a little bit. All right. Let's go do this battle up here. Get my Pokemon's nice and strong, and keep moving on here. Are you are you like the daycare lady? I always give it my best when I'm around kids and Pokemon, lady. Don't don't be. Don't be saying that too too loudly. Okay, nursery aid, Kimya. It's a, sounds it sounds very Japanese. We got Dunsparce. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's just use a sand attack here just to just to get that a little bit lowered. You know, what? I might use assist just to use it once, just because it seems like really cool. I right, was gonna use defense curl, which is not great, but I'm gonna use assist just once just to see what I get. And it is a tackle. Woo! Snap. All right, I'm gonna have to switch to. Uh, I'm. I'm gonna have to switch to. Pork chop in order to get off some uh, some fire fire moves that can uh, not be affected by those defense curls. You spite spite. You get nothing because I didn't use a move with pork chop. Ember does a little bit, doesn't do that much. He's in pursuit. I'm not gonna do that much if I don't switch out, but that would have been unfortunate if I would have used that with uh, with Pussy, but that really wouldn't have done anything. And I get the burn, very nice. Wouldn't have really done anything with Pussy just because Pussy's a dark type uh, Pokemon, so. No, not my PP. Anything but my PP. Don't take that away from me. Yeah, alright. Critical hit. Porkchop getting a ton of experience there up to level 15. Pussy probably up to level... Oh, Flame Charge! So, new move. What do we got? What do we got? It cloaks itself with flame and attacks, building up more power. It raises user's speed. Alright. That's a that's a physical move, too. So, that's... That's good. Alright, let's get rid of uh, Tail Whip. And we will teach... Flame Charge! That's cool. So now I have a special and physical attack with fire for uh, pork chop. So we defeat Kimya. Oh no, I'm not very good example to the kids, am I? Oh, Kimya knew. No. Because you just let them wander around by themselves. What's wrong with you, lady? Dire hit. I think that's one of those like special moves, uh, special items, like the axe attack and whatnot. Do I have full health here? I don't think so. I'm gonna use a potion. To uh, heal up pork chop. Here we go. And uh, throw in an orange berry. Why not? Give you that. And we are set for this double battle. Woo! All right. Whoa! Twins! Crazy. Two Pokemon, strong and strong, come together to become very strong. Um, one plus one isn't three. You're right. You went to school! Good job! Yes, we got twins, Leah and Lily. And we got two, uh, two Sunkerts. So that's cool. Uh, go with, uh, you know, pork chop and, uh, pussy. Got my fire type moves out there, so that will be good against these guys. Fortunately. Ooh, you know what? Let's use flame charge and just see how that, uh, see how that shit looks. One old big old scratch, and that almost does half, so this flame charge will easily be able to defeat this. But that looks super cool, wow. 
Got that whole flame going around the body. Sort of like, uh, sort of like flame wheel, except it looks kind of cooler, I think. You get the speed increase too, so that's good. Absorb. Use it on pork chop. Wow, you're dumb. Come on, lady. You should know, ladies. You should know better than this. That's not gonna do nothing. One little ember and poof. That sunker is sunk. <laughs> oh. And a little bit of experience when we defeat the twins. Oh no, we lost. My Pokemons are all burned to a crisp. So let's go find a Pokemon Center here and see what- Whoa, hold up there. Hello, oh you! You are with four Pokemon, but if you have more Pokemon, your journey should be a lot more fun. Here, I'll give you these, so why don't you catch more Pokemon? Oh, sweet, great balls. Thanks, dude. You know what they say, cheerful company shortens the miles. Alrighty, thanks, dude. Appreciate the great balls. Whoa, it just started raining, apparently. My X receiver's ringing? Awesome! Well, who's there? Oh, Mom, what's going on? Ah, uh, it's your mom. Yeah, I can, I can see you, Mom. We got this device. It's like Skype, except cooler. Where are you right now? Wow, Verbang City? There's a complex there, right? Have you been there yet? The way it looks at night, it's really quite nice! And you can train your Pokemon there! You know, your Pokemon can do some things, and you can do others! I hope you all work together and accomplish amazing things! I was acting like Mom didn't understand how the telephone worked and tried to yell. What the hell's going on here? Roxy, don't try to stop me! I'm off to Pokestar Studios to live up to my true potential! My dream is to be a ship captain and a movie star. Get real, you're a captain already, aren't you? If that ship doesn't move, you're going to cause a lot of trouble. Oh, dear daughter. You split your time between your responsibilities as a gym leader and with your band, right? I can do that too! Oh! Oh, I'm such a good actor! Ah! You dim-witted, dense, dumb, daft, dippy, dorky, doltish doofus! Doing double duty isn't the problem, you're causing problems for people! Keeping people from getting where they're going because of the sheer selfishness of unforgivable! I've had it! I'm going to the gym! Damn, that rock star is super pissed! Let's go to the Pokemon Center! Hooray! Get all my Pokemons healed up nice and good here. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. I can heal your shit up real nice here. And all your Pokemon will feel super good. Thanks, lady. I appreciate it. Dude, you got any medals for me yet? Been waiting for you. You've done terrific. Here's a new medal. Oh, shit. I got a medal. The Light Walker medal. And I have another. Shh. What? Step-by-step -step saver medal. Another medal? What? The Pokemon Center fan medal? Jesus Christ, this guy just keeps giving me medals! Dollars are beginning medal. Oh, five medals? Battle Learner medal. Mm, Titan. I'd like you to collect more medals, so I'll give you a hint medal. Fifteen more medals of hints! Ah! Ah! My heart can't take all these medals and greatness! Oh! Mercy me! Well, let's go look for this lady here. Uh, you got any idea what's going on? If I didn't have Pokemon, I'll work at the complex would make me a wreck. Well, okay then. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's check out this trash bin. Probably some shit in there. Oh yeah, an antidote. Who threw away an antidote? Bunch of bitches, that's who. Alright, let's see who's in here. It's a bunch of kids! And they got these Pokemon! These stupid, these Pokemon nowadays look so fucking stupid. Look at that. It's like a trumpet Pokemon or something. Fucking chair Pokemon. Come on, get fucking creative. Wait, they're not Pokemon. They're just a trumpet and a chair. Okay. <laughs> My Pokemon needs to be wimpy, but they've trained in the complex and now they're very buff. We gotta find this complex. I want some buff Pokemon. Shit. We're at the Verbank Complex. And this is a new area. Uh, Verbank City. This is a new area. We can catch a Pokemon here. But, uh, I'm gonna hold up on that for a second. 
Is this a new area still? Or is this still part of the complex? I think this is still part of the complex. So we're gonna catch a Pokemon here first. Let's go grab that Pokeball. Hopefully we get something super cool! X accuracy? Wow! That's not useful. Alright. We found a Pokemon! Who will it be? It's a Magnemite! Alright. I'll, I'll, I'll take that. Magnemite. Probably gonna be useful. Um, I don't know what to use on Magnemite, though. Although, you know what? Since it's raining, since it's raining, I will bet that Pork Chops, uh, you know what? Let's use Bubbles, actually. Ah, shit, that's, no, no, no. Bubbles is a normal type, so Magnemite won't be super effective with any electric attacks. So the Bubble will be more effective, but Steel isn't, uh, affected by water, uh, as a super effective attack, so Water Gun should be fine. Thundershock's not going to hurt too much. Yeah, that's fine. It does 10 damage. So that's going to do extra damage because of the water as well. Because uh, it's raining. So Supersonic misses again. All right, Bubbles. Way to go. All right, so I can do, I'd say, one more. One more water gun and I should be good. Oh, no, not Supersonic. Anything but Supersonic. You gotta go fast, apparently, in order to get past this confusion. Hey, Water Gun is useful. Alright, I could probably do one more, but I'm gonna be safe. Uh, switch into Pussy. Just so that Bubbles doesn't take any more attacks. And then, uh, start hucking some balls. See if we can, uh, see if we can catch Magnemite here. Thundershock! Doesn't do too much. Alright, that does nine there. Let's throw Pokeball! Go, Pokeball! Go! Alright, come on! Catch him, catch him, catch him, catch him, catch him, catch him! One, two, three! He's caught! Woo! Magnemite was caught! Alrighty. Let's take a look at the data. It's a magnet Pokemon, obviously. <laughs> the electromagnetic waves emitted by the units. At the sides of its head repel anti-gravity, which allows it to float. So let's give this Magnemite a nickname, shall we? Okay, got a nickname for this little guy. I'm gonna call him Jack. That's not it though. I'm gonna call him Jack Black, cause he's such a metalhead. Aha, aha, aha. It works super good. <laughs> All right, let's head back to the Pokemon Center here quick, just to, uh, heal up. Whoop, that's not the right way. Up further. Rain like a motherfucker named Verbank. But that is the complex, apparently, I need to go to in order to, uh, get my Pokemon nice and strong. Uh, I'll probably level up Magnemite. Level up Jack Black. And, uh, let's see. Let's take a look at him quick. Jack Black! Yeah! What's up? Yeah! Adamant Nature. Uh... I think that means higher special attack and lower, uh, lower attack. If I'm not mistaken. I might be mistaken. I don't quite know. If blue's good or what. Uh... Might be the opposite. Red might be good. Either way! Got Jack Black. And if it's the opposite way, then Jack Black, uh... Not as useful as he could be if his special attack was getting raised higher than his attack. He'd be a lot more useful than if his attack is being powered up than his special attack. Past here is the Charming Wonder Pokestar Studios, movie studios, auditions. We're having a look at the captain's acting. No, unauthorized people. Well, I see this game likes to uh, put you in a box. Make sure you go on your path. Fuck you, I'm going this way. Oh, it's Pat Rat. What's up, Pat Rat? It says hog, apparently. Oh, this watch hog, sorry. Uh, it's got keen eye ability. Yeah, dude, right? Oh, Rockstar, just Roxy's band. It's getting hard to buy tickets to their shows lately. Maybe they'll go on a world tour soon. Maybe, old guy looking out at the, uh, the ocean there. There's uh, some ships. It's a pretty cool place. What's this, is this the Pokemon gym? Doesn't look like much of a gym. That's the gym. Uh, 
trash can's empty. It must be a poison type gym. Yep, poison, I guess. Alrighty, Roxy's poison is intention. It stings, stings, and stings. You know what I did? I caught a Magnemite in the complex, and I did just fine. Here, I'll give you these so you can catch a Magnemite or something. Sweet, more Pokeballs! Thanks, dude. So Magnemite's apparently gonna be good against uh, Roxy. Good to know. Good to know. What the? Oh, there's a guy down there. I can go, let's go talk to this guy. What's up, guy? What's going on? Yo, this is a good deal. Why don't you trade your Pokeball for my Great Ball? Alrighty. Cool. Uh, I guess. See, it's a good deal, isn't it? We can trade again tomorrow if you want. All right. That guy is dumb. I guess if once I get a ride, I can come back here and uh, fish in the water here. But let's uh, well, let's see what else is in this uh, this grass here, quick. Anything? If we catch, if we see another Magnemite, I'm just gonna skedaddle. But we will check. It is a pint of ah man again something I would have liked. Of course, I find a Gen 1 type Pokemon. Which is not what I want. What do I know here? Tackle. Oh, I do know Thundershock, so let's just take this Pido out. Super effective Thundershock. So that'll be very nice against this Pido. And almost kills a one shot, but, you know, two levels under. It's pretty good. Pido it just looks really cool, too, I think. I mean, it's just a pigeon, but it's interesting. I like Starly too. Starly's pretty cool. I don't know. What, I forget what Starly, what what bird Starly is based on, but I like Starly a lot from Gen Four. But we are uh, we're deeper in the complex here now, so uh, let's talk to this fat guy. Yo, hey there, trainer. Looks like you've got an energetic Pokemon there. You got. Can I do a favor? Need to get these workers fired up. How about it? Help out a guy? Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah, that's what I like to hear. There are some workers here in the complex. Go get, uh, three rare and to go. Alright. What's that mean? I'm supposed to battle them, or...? That guy's too high up. Okay. Oh, shit. Wow. You scared me there, kid! I didn't see you there. Alright, time for a Pokemon battle. Let's begin! Uh! Alright, you got a youngster here. Youngster... I, I'm not even gonna try it. He's some, uh, Japanese man. It's gonna battle me with a little pup. Unfortunately, it's like unfortunately I can't really use a uh, pork chop here because of the rain. But I think thunder shocks will do fine. Odor sleuth, it's gonna identify me. I wish I had a dark type move on on uh, on on pussy. I wish I had bite. I, I don't even know when you learn bite, but. So little pup's not really gonna be able to do too much to Jack Black here, and uh, a couple of thunder shocks should uh, should take care of this little pup. He's bite, still not very effective, and I flinched though, but that's not good. Come on, man, quit with the biting. Not very effective, and I flinched again. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. Little pup, stop it! Teach your Pokemon not to bite. It's very rude. You jerk! All right, I gotta heal up. Come on, potion. Jack Black, you're better than this. Come on. You gonna take this shit from a little pup? Cripes. All right, one more thunder shock. This little pup will be six feet under. All right. Nope. Tackle this. Yeah, Jack Black's not very fast. All right. So that little pup is done. And Jack Black up to level 11. Very nice. All right. Learn Sonic Boom. Which uh, does not miss. Whew, you're way too strong. I know, dude, right? I'm pretty good. Uh, what else we got in here? Some more grass. More trainers. But I think that is where I will end it for this episode. I'm going to go back and uh, heal up Jack Black. But I will be back here for my next episode. So I'll th uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.